Hello crafters, this is Suzanne from A Creative Muse and I'm gonna show you how to set up the starter kit. I am still very impressed by this glue, the Barely Art Glue. So, let's get started. I told you that I had bought a two ounce of the Barely Art Precision Craft Glue. I like the smaller bottles just for my hand. I don't like having the big heavy bottle in my hand when I'm, you know, doing this type of thing. There is a two ounce bottle and then there's a bigger four ounce bottle. Normally I use um, art glitter glue, but the difference between these two is this one's a little, it comes out a little bit thicker. This one comes out a little bit thinner and you can do little dots. Both of them, you have this fine precision tip. This one is just a little bit finer. The needle on this one is a little short, like a standard needle and therefore sometimes this one can clog easier. This one comes with a much longer needle. And when you open it up, they say that this needle is for cleaning. I keep it in here. I store it in here just to keep this from clogging because once wet glue dries in here, yeah, yeah, your tip, it's gonna be hard to get it back out. The good thing with this glue, unlike this one, you can buy this cap set if this clogs and you can't save it, you can always keep your bottle, you know, put on the regular cap that it comes with. So I would save that and then get this replacement top part. Let's get into Barely Art. So I have a second one. So let's install this one. And why do I have a second one? Because I know some of you are going to be like, well, if you have one, that's good enough. <laughs> it comes in a cute little box, right? I wanted to have a second one for down here when I'm crafting and mainly for my crop bag, my scrapbooking event bag. I usually keep two of my essentials. See what I'm talking? It comes with this cap. That's what we're gonna put the nib on. So I zoomed the camera down and let's go into it. This is a great glue, got it on sale. Cat scrappiness. A good reason to buy from her she normally has it in stock. This thing sells out very, very quickly. You can buy it on Amazon, but you are gonna be paying more for it. There's my two ounce bottle. Also, it comes with this little kit. And so for a little sidebar about the glue, right here, they included this. So let's talk about it. You see where it says on the bottom, cleaning pin? Cleaning pin, clean tips after each use. No. <laughs> no so I'm just using it as a storage pin and if it does get gunky pull it out I just normally wipe it like so just take my fingers and rub on it I'm not sticking myself because I'm going down I'm not going back up I'm just pulling in one direction that normally cleans it you could probably even use a cotton ball with a little bit of isopropyl alcohol to wipe it off if it gets really really gunky I would be careful of using undo goo gone or anything like that if you do use that use the undo clean the needle then go back in maybe with water and clean it and clean it and then dry it so now you know everything is off of it then attach it here you could probably wipe it too with the isopropyl but i would make sure you would clean it after that because i don't know what those chemicals will do to the glue once it's in here okay so if you are going to go a different route in terms of getting the pin clean, dry it. Use water and then dry it so then it's pretty much clean going back in. Alrighty, moving on into video. The one we're usually looking for is this. I don't do the storage tip either. I just leave the ultra fine tip and stick that pin and then it's always ready to go. When these glues normally clog up is when you're using it and you just leave it out like this. For a long time whatever is in here that's what normally starts drying up so good habit is use it cap it and then go back into your project it doesn't dry that fast it is quick drying but it's not crazy quick drying this one actually dries I find a, a little bit quicker than this the main difference with this, this is an all year round glue, so it doesn't matter where you're living. This one, if it's winter time, they won't ship it to you because the glue does freeze. So that's a drawback of that glue. I live in South Florida. So for me, something like that isn't really a big deal. Alrighty, so here's a cute little 
test tube thing. I don't know. It just You can keep the rest stored in it. And here now, as you can see, these are the three tips. The, what was it called? Ultra fine. Fine. This is more like reminiscent of this to make it thicker. And then the storage. I don't use these two, so I'll put them back in here. Cap it. There you go. So they say that this, this is for cleaning. I just keep it, I just use it for storage. Now what I was saying is they do sell this kit. If this thing clogs, you can cap the bottle back with this. So keep this storage top that I'm gonna take off my new bottle of glue now. Here we go. Comes with a little safety seal thing. And I would cap it back and then order another refill or just have a backup. And I noticed some of the accessories are sold out too because I think other crafters have the same idea. that They're like, well, this thing, you know, it doesn't clog easy, but all these things, it's glue. It clogs. And if you're using it and you forget to cap it, you come back a half an hour later, oh, you better believe it. It'll, <laughs> it'll be clogged up. So let me just take off this safety seal stuff. Clean that up. Just using my nail and just rubbing it and keeping it nice and clean. Alrighty, before I start the install. So you're going to take this cap, the little top part, and I'm going to now cap it. So now when you look in here, it has a little bit of threading in here. And that's where you're going to now screw this in. This has threading as well. There, there you can see the threading. So you're going to pop it on here. And... Apply pressure, downward pressure, so going down, and twist. And that's it. And it'll stop. There. There. And now, let's test. Barely. Let's go with the barely. And there we go. Thick. Dot, 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 dot. Good. And that's it, folks. Now I have two bottles. <laughs> of barely art glue and i'm loving this glue so much i sure did get a 14.99 i think it's 14 yeah refill bottle the 11 ounce refill bottle it comes yes this big it'll stay like this until i need it for right now this will last me for a while so don't think because it's a two ounce bottle you don't use a ton of this stuff but i just wanted to have this ready just for my sanity keep this store this someplace and store this too I would put these both in a Ziploc bag and put it in my little craft drawer so I'll and maybe even write a note on it so I know exactly what it's for, okay? Have some fun with some Barely Art Glue. I get mine from Cat Scrappiness because she has it in stock, both sizes and the refill. Alrighty, crafters, on to the next video. Stay crafty, my friends. Enjoy some Barely Art Glue. Bye.